Hey guys, Gunther Vincent, Director of Marketing with Tomate. I hope you guys are doing great today. I got my pal, Chris Anderson, Vice President of Tomate with me, hey. like always. And we got some cool stuff to talk about. I know we got a veiled surprise here. Yeah. We usually don't do that because we got something very exciting to reveal. Yep, we, we, we are very excited about this. So first of all, it's good to be doing these uh, so often again. You know, a couple of years ago, we were really rocking and rolling with this uh, and, and had a little lull, uh, but I, I'm enjoying the time we're spending together. And it's all been brought on by uh, a lot of product development that's been taking place. That's, that's the thing, you know, we, we're a small company and we, are, we all wear a lot of hats. And so, you know, we don't get to do as much as we uh, want to in the marketing side, as much as we get to, you know, as, as much as we want to really do. So we develop a lot of stuff and now we're going to get to talk about it. Let's talk about this thing and let's reveal her. All right, let's see. Presto. Boom. That's the bottom of a light bar. And there it is. This is now a 36 inch Tomate wireless light bar that runs on the Milwaukee M18 battery. So I know a lot of you guys have made the adaptation of your bars uh, yourselves. Um, unfortunately, there is an issue in doing that. Uh, the voltage from these batteries is too high without a step down board and it will burn out the LEDs at which point they're not warranty. We now have a factory solution that we're bringing to you. It's the TM36 M18. And uh, if you take a look here, you've got this nice handle with the integrated shoe for your battery. It snaps into place and you're ready to rock and roll. Uh, that bar burns nice and bright, gives clear signals wirelessly. Um, as with, you know, all of our Tomate products, this still has the lifetime warranty on electronics and LEDs um, because, like I said, we have uh, the proper electronics in it for this. So um, you're going to get great runtime. Uh, you know, a lot of you guys already have these batteries. Tomate does not offer the Milwaukee M18 battery, uh, but uh, they are widely available in the market. Um, but, uh, yeah, so I know it's been a long time coming, uh, and we've shown some of the other items we have. I think, uh, the last episode we showed the T box, uh, that allows you to wirelessly control a trailer, um, as though, uh, it, it had wireless turn signals and brakes and that runs off the M18 battery. So we, we've now got that integrated as a turnkey solution for you guys, uh, with our, our 36 inch wireless bars. This is definitely one of the most ecological solutions because you're using one battery for multiple different devices on your truck. So we are very excited to be able to offer this on our light bars now. Uh, and it's gonna be on multiple different bars as well, right? Absolutely. So uh, you will begin to see this integrated into, into more products. Um, on our heavy duty light bars, it is now available across the board on all of our you know, TM36, TM48s, uh, you know, even the MO37, uh, that sort of thing. Uh, any bars that come in this style housing, uh, it is available for. Right. So um, we're glad to bring that. And yeah, I mean, like you say, it's uh, it, it does have an environmental factor to it. You're, you're not having to change the batteries out every one to two years with the lead acid batteries. Um, and, uh, you know, and, and then where do those go? You know, you got to take them to the recycling plant. Um, and, uh, so it, it's more environmentally sound, but above all, it streamlines your processes out there in the field. Uh, it makes it where you don't have to worry about it. You have many of these batteries on, on your charging stations around the shop, pulling off, you got it for your tool. You got it for your bar. You're good to go. So, uh, just another, another thing that, uh, you know, we, we've been working on to make your lives, uh, that much easier may not seem like a lot until uh, you need your bar on the go and you know you forget to charge it or whatever. Um, the now, main, the just, main thing I don't want to forget to talk about is it makes your bar very, very cost effective because you don't have to buy that battery. You don't have to maintenance the battery either. So you already have the battery that's on your truck. You get to use it and you don't have to buy another one. 
Right. So there you go. Yeah. Yeah. You're not dropping the, you know, 60, 70 bucks every, every two years on, on replacement batteries. That, and also the bar itself is cheaper because you're not having to pay for the battery that's included with the bar. There is some savings that, that occurs because of that. Um, uh, you know, th this piece here that holds the battery, uh, it, it, it's less than the pair of batteries that were previously in here, but, um, you know, it is still, it, it is a net savings overall, any way you dice it. So you, you nailed the, the, the nail, the head of the nail with the hammer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so when, when you said that, so we, uh, we're, we're very pleased to bring this to you guys and, uh, can't wait to, to start seeing them out in the field. Uh, now we did have some that we got in the field um, with a previous design. Uh, really looked a lot like most of yours that, out there that have done that the adaptation with that little red shoe on it. Um, those work great, uh, and that's why we you know took the step to integrate it into this nice handle assembly here. And uh, yeah, like I say, can't wait to see them out there. So that is the TM36 M18. So uh, ask your local dealer about it and uh, they'll give you the scoop on, on pricing and availability. Uh, but these are ready to ship now. Nice. So that is the biggest news of the day uh, when it comes to the tow light side of things. Now we'll pivot here and uh, kind of expand on last on, on the last episode. Uh, as, as many of you saw, uh, the Lifesaver uh, we adapted the back of it so that it not only fits on a cone, but uh, that it would fit on your looper cones or your channel or not the loop, the delineator and the uh, channelizer cones uh, available through Uline. We've taken it a step further now um, and actually made a universal mount for these posts. As you see here, we've got straps with a nice heavy duty clip on it. Uh, it's universal to pretty well any of these style posts. I think they, they call them looper cones, channelizer cones, and delineator cones. Uh, and so I'm relatively new to the terminology, but you get the picture here. Uh, with the Lifesaver, for those that are not familiar, this is an auxiliary warning light uh, to help give advanced notice to worker, to, automo to, to motorists on the highway as they're approaching a work site. So there's a version that slides over the top of a cone. This version is the uh, the TM-LS-LCD Looper Channelizer Delineator uh, dash STND. And so uh, th this goes on pretty well any of these posts that you see out on the highway uh, or that you know you're setting up on your job sites uh, for construction or uh, roadside work of any sort where you utilize these. It's now got a strap version that's pretty well universal. On the traffic cones, you're still gonna wanna go with the standard uh, just simply by the merit of how it sits on the cone. It's you know uh, specifically engineered to sit on a cone and project uh, directly towards the, the motorist coming your way. Uh, so you, know, you would still want that one for cone scenarios, uh, but now we have a truly universal mount for the posts and that is the TM-LS dash LCD dash S T N D the standard, uh, Tomate lifesaver, um, and, and, and the subsequent looper cone channelizer delineator cone, uh, mount version. So, uh, you know, with these, you press the button, uh, the, they're going to come standard out of the box programmed to flash red and blue, uh, as that is the most attention grabbing color combination out there. Uh, since it's not mounted to a vehicle or used in motion, uh, it is federally legal to operate them as such. Uh, you'll definitely want to check your state and local uh, uh, ordinances to, to ensure that that is the case. But on a federal level, it is legal. In the case you get hassled, they can be simply changed to amber and white by swiping a magnet over it uh, or any combination thereof, red, blue, and amber and white. So uh, that's really what we've got for you today. I was just really excited about the, uh, the M18 powered light bar. And, uh, you know, we see these things all over the place, these yeah. posts. So, uh, you know, probably more so than just the standard traffic cone these days. So also very exciting to be able to show that. Uh, hopefully some of you guys out there with the, uh, the highway departments 
and uh, the highway construction crews are seeing seeing this and and know that there are further layers of safety and visibility available to you. These things run for about 24 hours on a charge. And uh, as with all of the Tomate products made in the USA and uh, carry a lifetime warranty on electronics and LEDs. Appreciate you guys watching us today and we'll see you next time on Tomate TV.